Hey, good morning. Uh, I'm gonna do a morning vlog. I haven't done one of these before, and I was gonna show you. It's it's like four degrees out here. I went and got the kids some donuts earlier, and the Tahoe said four degrees. There's no wind, so that helps. But I'm gonna go out here and water the rabbits and the chickens. The water's frozen over, obviously, and uh, I was just gonna show you guys that. I'm going, I'm going out of um, town, out of, actually out of state for, for most of the day. So I'm going to go ahead and get all the chores done before I leave. And then hopefully this afternoon it warms up a little bit. I can split some wood. Because we've been burning a lot of wood here the last uh, week and a half. Because the temperatures have been in the teens and 20s. And, uh, you know, just freezing weather. But the rabbits, they see me coming, they're pretty thirsty. Look at him. We'll go ahead and water the, I'll show you water the chickens too. One thing I found out already is these waters, which I should have known already, are crap during the winter. So I got some heavy bowls that I got. I've had them for a while, we don't ever use them. So I thought, why not use them for the water? And they'll down this water uh, fat real quick before I, probably before I even get done watering the other one, they'll have half this drank. And so I'll, I'll fill it back up again. That's one thing I found out about rabbits, being new to having rabbits. Yeah, they're down it. They drink a lot of water. Never really realized that. I put some carrots in there last night for him, and I guess that one put it in the bowl. It's frozen solid. It's funny. Let's see if I can't break this glass. I usually break stuff. So chip some of this ice out just enough where I can fill. It can get some water before I leave, and I'll water them again when I get back. Yeah, they got that sucked down. See if I can't get this in there. They got plenty of food. Looks like they ate all their carrots. I got this last night at Walmart's, my new uh, rabbit water and chicken water for the cold weather. start running in there. You better not escape. Let's get back.
Hopefully they drink some water before it freezes over. Jeez. Let me come out and clean this coop out. It's gotta get a little bit warmer though. Let's see, the rabbits are still drinking. <laughs> they better get their fill now. I'll come water them again when I get back from Missouri. The sun's out. The sheep, I've had a problem before this cold front came in. I filled up their their big water tank. But uh I don't know. I guess I didn't fill it up all the way. Because now it's uh it's getting pretty low. And I was gonna fill it up yesterday and uh the water line is frozen. Not the actual line, but the water hose where I'll show you guys. Um, it's frozen, so I couldn't get it filled up. So when I get home this afternoon, this evening, I guess I'll get some five gallon buckets and uh, bring out here and uh, fill it up. I got my uh, my ice, my de-icer on it. Um, you know, the trough uh, warmer and they'll come running over here. I'll show, them, show you guys, but they're getting pretty low on water. And I'll take care of that when I get to get home this afternoon, this evening. I'll show you guys the sheep. See, they got a little bit of water. That uh, that heater works awesome. I thought I, I came out here like three. Quick, Gabby, Gabby, get back. I came out here. Two days ago when we was getting this really deep hard cold uh, weather coming in and I hooked it all up and because uh, it was start it was before it froze came out here the, a day and a half later and I didn't plug it in right there I plugged it in everywhere else except for right there you know they've been licking ice for a day so I felt pretty bad about that but they're good now they got enough to last them a couple more days but I'll bring some five gallon buckets out here later Give them some more water. Yeah, other than that, it's so cold right now. It's, you know, four or five degrees out here. You really can't do a whole lot. Well, I can't do a whole lot. I don't want to do anything. I'm sure you could if you had to. But it's supposed to get up in the 20s this afternoon, this evening. Hopefully, I get some daylight out here and I could finish splitting some wood. You know, because I've got about probably two or three rigs split but we're having these cold spells i'm going through it pretty quick right now when it gets this cold you really burn it don't matter how good a stove you got how efficient it is you're gonna burn it so that's really all i got going on right now guys i just wanted to do my first vlog i've been wanting to do one for a while and i seen big bear homestead did one last week i said like, man he beat me to it i've been wanting to do one of these for a while and uh if you guys like it um, I'll do some more. If not, I'll quit doing them. You guys probably don't care what I'm doing anyways. Not many people do. <laughs> My wife. But uh, Alright, well I'm going to get off here. And uh, hope you guys stay warm today. I don't know if you can see that. Here comes Gabby. You guys stay warm today and uh, have a safe weekend. And uh, Oh yeah, I'll tell you real quick. Um, whoever's watching this, what I'm going to cook later on. I'm going to cook some potato soup over the uh, open fire. That's going to be my video coming out Monday, sneak peek. Um, it's going to be cold, but uh, I'm going to get it done. We like potato soup, and uh, I think you guys are really going to like that video. It's a good recipe. All right, guys, thanks for watching.